Howdy folks, welcome to Shaman Kobe's Emporium of Awesome. Today we're going to do a Pokemon opening. I'm just going to do a random one. There's nothing big and special all stuff about it, but I felt like kind of just opening a few packs that I happen to have around. So I have a tin here of Shining Fates that I was able to find. That's got two booster packs in it. And then I'm also got a couple other random ones all stuff lying around. So I got a Darkness of Blaze. I got a Chilling Rain, I got a Vivid Voltage, and I got one of these Japanese Dream Collection also packs. Um, I ended up ordering two of them, mainly because of the pack art. I really enjoyed uh, I, which, um, Dragonite, is probably my favorite also Pokemon of all. So as soon as I found out also that there was a pack art like this, also, I'm like, oh, I gotta get it. I'm like, well, I might as well get two, so then I can open one and see what's inside. I really don't know what cards also are in this. But Japanese cards are beautiful, and so I am going to enjoy opening it no matter what. So I'm going to open that one on stuff today on stuff. That one will be last. But yeah, so a bunch of packs and that. So I uh, hope everybody on stuff is doing great. Thank you very much for tuning in to the video today. I also picked on stuff this pack, or this specific one, because I really like Celebi too. So I figured also a cool Celebi tin would be nice too. There's a little Blastoids pin. A couple over there. And we got two Shining Fates also packs. So we'll just throw them in between there like so. And we'll see if we can pull anything cool also if we're not. Like I said, thank you very much also for watching the videos. I really enjoy making these videos for people to to see. I'm hoping also to get to 100 subscribers. I think I'm at like 85 right now. So once we get up to 100 on stuff, I'll um, figure out also what kind of video on stuff I'll do. Something a little bit more spicy maybe. And I'll probably end up doing a giveaway on stuff in that one too. Like I did on stuff before for my 50th on stuff. See if I can get some more people on stuff to watch and continue growing. And the more people I watch, the more happy I'll be honest so I really enjoy it and I really enjoy seeing the, the people also and people's comments also so please like I say if you like it also please leave a like down below um please comment and that also I really appreciate anybody else who is here and anybody else who comments I always try also to respond also so okay first pack darkness of blaze Milo I can feel you my kitty also is down there there we go. There's a code card also for anybody also who happens to play the online game. Four. Energy. Rare fossil. Simisage. Simapore. Lavatar. I think that's a really cute, cute art also on that. Nicket. Bone sweet. Snubble. Melton, Twitch Trio as the reverse, and Melmental. Okay, pack number one. Milo, do you want to come visit? Yeah, come visit. You can go home. I'll show you. This is Milo. This is little Milo. Hmm? You like coming and joining us, don't you? Hmm? You watch it? Yeah, see? Yeah. You can sit up on the table if you want. You can come to the stand on the table and look. Okay, we're going to do the next shiny fates. Hmm? Yeah, Joe. <laughs> He's so cute. Okay. Next code card also for whoever else is lucky enough to grab that. Three, four. I haven't opened a shiny fates in awesome in quite a while actually. Rush Shield, Elder Ghost. I'm right. Opened a lot of this on awesome stuff for sure when I Ooh, I like that EV card. And it's a very cool set of awesome stuff to open for sure. Snom, Tropius, and a Thebo. Hollow. Cool. 
Okay, Chili Ring, the newest set also that I've built. It's been out for a while. Now the, the newer, newer set also is actually right around the corner also called Evolving Skies, which everybody also is going, going to go bonkers over also. It has lots, lots of the evolutions and stuff in it. So look, really looking forward and stuff to getting, hopefully getting a hold and stuff for that. Uh, I'd like to collect some, so I'd like to hopefully I can get some so I can open it here and so I can also put it away and stuff for collecting because I'm really I really enjoy the evolutions and stuff as well. I opened if you've been on the channel, I opened also the EV Heroes Japanese set and so like that over that had all the ones and this one is kind of ones also that grab stuff from that plus another set and kind of combined it into one and, and that and that's the one that's coming out. So, honey, Mionia, Lillian, Sobble. Porygon, are fetched, Gary Bird, Impact Energy, and a Glarian Slowking. Oh, okay. Back to Shiny Fates. Unfortunately, with Shiny Fates, also, so much of it came out that a lot of the prices also of, every, of it all dropped fairly quickly because there's just so much out there but that's okay it's still a very fun set on stuff to try and pull stuff you get lots of shinies and so for it and the hit rates on it were pretty good and all stuff for sure especially compared to all stuff the next sets that came out like battle styles and even chilling rain on stuff the pulls on those were seemed a lot lower even though they were probably pretty average on and that else everybody got spoiled by shining fates pull rates so Kuki, Mopeko, Tudo, another Eevee, uh, Reverse Hollow Mopeko, and a Young Mega. Okay, come on. Let's try to get us up at least one hit and so like that on stuff would be nice out of these. So, okay, Vivid Voltage. I haven't opened Vivid Voltage in a long time either. Uh, so it, that was, I really enjoyed this set on stuff. There was a lot of cool cards in it. Also, of course, everybody searching on stuff for that. Rainbow Pikachu on stuff that is in the set. I've never got it, never seen it, unfortunately. But it was always a fun set. I always liked that this one had the amazing rares in it also, which I always loved pulling those ones. Those ones were always really cool. So I was able to find some Vivid Vultures on stuff for good prices around, so I thought, what the heck? I'll grab some of those so I can reopen it in our stuff again. Voltorb, Rockruff, Ninjask. And a Jolteon. Cool. Alright. So, we got those packs. Now, let's open. Dream Collection. The AC2A Dream Collection, I think, is what it is. Only has got like five packs in it and that. I kept one for my collection. I'm trying to collect pack art and uh, stuff from every set. So, I don't try to collect like, every, like the whole art set. I just try to find uh, stuff the one art pack and so that I like the best and I grab that one from whatever set so I'm just kind of working my way on uh, stuff back and the farther I get the more expensive I get but I haven't gone very far on uh, stuff yet so they've been pretty affordable so far and every once in a while I'm throwing in some of these Japanese packs that I really love like this one I'll put in there um, the Eevee Heroes that were there and then probably any other ones that I can find for Pokemon uh, stuff that I really like so I'm opening this pack good thing I'm not saving that pack jeez I have no idea what the card trick is on it. I really don't. For it, I think it may be one. I honestly don't know. So, watch out while we get the one. Also, like, right off the battle, we like the rare or something. Oh, yeah, I opened this in a really weird order, I think. <laughs> that, that, that's okay. Cool. And like I say, the Japanese packs and stuff are always... Is this Japanese? Maybe... Yeah. Maybe it's not Japanese. Maybe I got a... Maybe it's a Korean one. Honestly, don't know. That's funny, you know, that I thought it was a Japanese one. It might not be. <laughs> apparently. But that's okay too, huh? So I got it for the pack art. I love the pack art. So that whatever the cards are in it... I don't think this is Japanese because it doesn't have the different back to it so maybe it's like the Korean one or something but either way 
that was fun not to open. Unfortunately, no big hits and uh, stuff in any of those packs. So that kind of that kind of sucked, but I still enjoy opening packs. I still enjoy uh, stuff making content on uh, stuff for people out there on uh, stuff to watch to be able to get uh, stuff the the code cards as well. Three to two for the colored ones. And yeah, as long as I can keep finding the stuff and as long as I keep enjoying it, I'm gonna keep doing it. Um I will have another video coming soon with my son. He has one of the rapid actions of it that boxes from Battle Styles and also that he's gonna open. So we'll be doing that sometime down the road for him to see what cards he can get and also that he would like to play with. And we'll be, yeah, I'll be doing also more videos coming up. I hope you everybody enjoys it. I really appreciate anybody that watches on stuff and spends the time on stuff to watch me on stuff open Pokemon packs on stuff. I've been trying continuing my hunt on stuff for the chase cards or cards that I like, things like that. So I really enjoy it and I really appreciate it. So please leave a like down below. Please subscribe on stuff if you'd like to see more content and I will be doing it again very soon. So thank you very much. Until then, have a good day.